Only George Santos can bring me out of a NyQuil-induced coma to bring you this video. The house officially said bye to George Santos, despite having their dirty little secrets threatened to be revealed by him, which I'm sure we'll all be on standby for. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't dying to know who's been banging lobbyists, cheating on their spouses, and getting white girl wasted. But it seems like his colleagues didn't care because they could easily turn around and say, this guy's a liar. Anyways, who cares, right? He's gone. George Santos is officially the second most famous person from Long Island to crash and burn. That's a Billy Joel reference. Sorry, Billy. But I'd also be lying if I said I'm gonna miss George. Special elections in New York will take place to fill his seat. And whoever does has some pretty big stilettos to fill. Oh, Katara Ravash, the memories you have left us with. But now that you're out of a job, maybe you can join OnlyFans. I hear it's a fine way to make all the money back you stole to spend on OnlyFans. I also wonder what the return policy is for Hermes. Can't really afford the five G's you spent there, can you? But the only thing I'm truly worried about for you now is you not being able to afford all that Botox and filler upkeep. Gonna be a sad day when those dissolve. As someone who has had it out for you since the very beginning, today is a good day. It feels good to be back. I've missed you all. Anyways, bye!